Red Dye Test. For the red dye test, grab three clear water glasses of the exact same size. If you have fluoride filters, do not install them yet. This test is only for the black filters. Take the upper chamber with the filters and place it so that the two filters sit on top of your glasses. You can use the third glass for stability. Next, take your red dye vial and mix it with one gallon of water in a separate container thoroughly. Do not mix water and dye in the Berkey chamber. Pour the mixture in between the black filters inside the chamber. Add one more gallon of water to make sure the filters are completely submerged. When the water filters through, it should come out clear with no red dye noticeable. If your black filters pass the test, dump the water out of the chamber and grab your fluoride filters. Take the larger threaded side of the fluoride filter and screw it onto the stem of the black filter for eight revolutions. Do not go over eight full turns as you risk puncturing the screen inside of the filter if it is over tightened. Do the same for the second fluoride filter and you are ready to put your upper chamber back on top of the lower chamber. Your Berkey is now ready to be filled for the first time. Make sure your spigot is in the off position and fill your Berkey all the way to the top. When filling for the first time, discard the initial water and fill it a second time. If you don't completely use all the water in your Berkey within one to two days, you should empty and refill your Berkey with new water. This will keep the filter saturated and prevent you from having to prime the filters again.